Are you all right, Ilya? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Where is everyone else? I don't see them anywhere. They should be around here. Maybe. Then again, me tripping back there threw off our timing pretty badly. There's a chance we're a good distance away from each other. Are we also, like, not only distance, but also, like, years apart from, uh, Ronix and Milia? Well, we picked a good place to appear. Let's go look for them in this village first. How do we know they're near? It could take days to find them. Or literally decades. I just realized this outfit probably isn't going to work here. You're right. You'd stick out like a sore thumb. I'll go look around. Why don't you wait here? I'll go find something for you. Sorry for the trouble, but imagine what the captain must be going through. Well, good luck then. I don't get how her clothes are any more suspicious than our clothes. Well, first things first, I've got to find some women's clothing. Okay. Ooh. Blueberries. Look at that. Look look at the house. Look 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 at all the pixel art. Whoa, it's like Valkyrie profile. I mean kinda, not really. Can I can can, can I walk in that shadow and still get shadowed? Yes I can. Yes I can. Look at that. Did you know the fruits picked in this village are sold at high prices all across the world? Are they also sold expensively here? Or are they cheap here specifically due to exporting and stuff? If you go north from here, you'll find the town of Hot. Okay. Look at this. Such a pretty game. I've got to look for some clothes. You should view your status screen. <laughs> I always find it funny when NPCs mention stuff like this. You can charge your blade by holding A and letting go at the right time to... Uh, like, I don't know. Look at this interior. Whoa. Can I save? Nah. No. Welcome. Haven't seen you before. New in town? Ask about clothes. Um, do you have any clothes for a young woman on sale? A present for your girlfriend? No, I just... Just something normal would, 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 would be fine. Well, how about this? It's got kind of an adventurous flair to it, but I'd say it's normal enough. I, uh, I guess that'll work. That'll be five or ten full. He's acting weird, but oh well. Never... Yeah, take it. All right, I'll take it. Woo, thank you. Come again. All right, what did I just get? All right. I guess I can't look at them right now. Not from around here, are you? Have you tried our plum apples yet? <laughs> no, I have not. Look at this interior. I want to see pictures of all the interiors in this game, like fully spread out like wallpapers. Oh, I am so sick and tired of working in this dinky little item shop. It doesn't look so bad. This looks like it'd be an awesome place to work. Yeah, of working in this dinky little shop. I don't know. I think it'd be nice. Wait for me. You're in the village of Krat. All right, let's go in here. I like to fully explore these games. So, oh, chest. Oh, a lot of money. Hi. Hi. I decided to travel to the countryside on a whim, but now I'm stuck in this small town with nothing to do. This town looks awesome to me. Why is everybody so miserable? Look at that. There's no point staying here without the others. Oh, is this like a, like an inn? Like Final Fantasy had? Oh, chest. Resurrection Elixir. I wonder how my daughter's doing. Can I examine anything? No. All right. Oh, I cannot leave. Oh, I can't leave. Okay. Look at that. Look, look at the chimney. It looks like it's almost 3D modeled, but it's not. Can I zoom the camera out here? I don't know. Either way, I'm going to go to settings. I'm going to 
Uh, go to controls. I want to customize the controls a little bit. Select target. Special target. I, I, I know there's a button that zooms the camera out. But... It, it's not... Here. Okay. I guess I'll just go to normal. Also, I want to check out that. I'm going to change that to semi-auto to see how that plays. Nope. Okay, I almost made that mistake again. Oh my god. Ilya, I've got your clothes. Here you go. Thanks. No peeking now. Go away. Stop peeking. Jesus. Took him a long time to turn around. God. Um, sorry to complain, but this is way too loose on me. I don't think it'll even cover my chest. You're not even wearing it. Uh, well, I'll just go like this then. Oh, are you sure? Well, there's nothing else I can do. I can't change back into what I had on earlier. So there was no point. Anyway, let's hurry. We need to stock up on supplies and rendezvous with the captain. What was the point of that? I'm not really sure what just happened here. Me neither. I'm guessing speedrunners just skipped that part. Okay. Oh look, we're in a we're we're in an overworld. Whoa. Right now? I like how these houses are 3D modeled. I like it a lot. I just think this game is very charming to look at. All right, I'm gonna save. Now seems like an awesome time to save because that was a very long cutscene. Is there anything else to do at this town? Anything. So is Ilya like a magic user? I don't know. Oh my gosh, go, go leave. Okay, okay. Can I sleep at the end now? Nah. I'm I'm good on a uh, on health I think. Hey, where do I go? I guess just onward. Go 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 go. Look at that. That's where the ship was, but it's in the past now. This ought to be a good fight. Whoa, she's fast. Nope. Oh, she's super weak. Ten out of ten. How do I lock onto any target I want? I don't know. Yeah, that ship that crashed was right here. It was right there. Remember that? I remember. Oh, what a pain. Here they come. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so without uh, semi-targeting on, the same button that would zoom out the camera is instead a target function. And then I can run up to any target I target onto, and then I can attack them like that. And then I can... Oh, stop running away from my attacks. There we go, okay. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of it. I wonder, I wonder if there's something all the way over there now. I'm gonna go check. Okay, there was literally nothing over there, so I cut all of that out. Nothing at all. Oh, oh my gosh, it's these guys. I like how from the side, these things look like they have carrots in their mouth. But from the front, they have like fangs. And they got some pretty cool attacking animations too. They, they like shoot you with their fangs. Who's that guy? First thing we need to do is visit all the nearby settlements. The captain's bound to turn up in one of them. That guy right there looks important. Sounds good to me. That ain't true and you know it. Stop screwing with me, you bastard. Huh? Let's talk to him. Where'd he go?
Okay, I guess he's gone now. All right. I want to know what he's all about. He seemed awfully rude to this uh, merchant guy. Some customers just got no respect. I know, right? I, I understand. I'm helping out my dad. <laughs> I'm helping. Where is he? I'm usually get I usually get my fish from Portsmouth, but it's been difficult lately with pirates blocking off all the fishing routes. Ronix Millie, huh? I can't say I've met them. A lot of adventurers and merc mercenaries pass through here, though. How do we even know we're in the right time period? Like, we we could be 100 years off. Do you know the names of all the kingdoms in the world? You mean like? In real life or in this game? Mm, there's nothing more to, for me to s say. No, I don't. Uh, the first is the Kingdom of Moi. Its territory extends across the continent where we are right now. From Port Smith to town north of here, you can go by ship to the Kingdom of Astral, home of the mighty Astral Knights. Going west by boat from there will take you to the Kingdom of An. And you can travel north from there onwards to get the Silvalent. Was that helpful? I don't know. Oh wait, you're the guy. Wait, you're no, you're not. Uh, Swordswoman, are you guys adventurers? I came all the way from Silvalent to visit my late master's grave. It was just one of those things that I knew I just had to do. Man, I'm so sorry for my reading comprehension. It, 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 it's just the font. Like, I swear it's just this font. Look at this interior. This is very pretty. Oh, it's, it's the guy. Uh, hey, you guys, adventurers too? Yeah. You are very clearly important. The camera panned up to you in the previous cutscene. So, what's your deal? You see that guy over there? He's got such a potty mouth. I bet he'd even make a sailor blush look at this interior it feels so warm and cozy in here <laughs> all right let's rest i wish we could get just i mean i i wish we could just get free rests at our house but i i guess our house doesn't even exist anymore because we're in the past No, okay. I thought maybe if I leave and re-enter, you you could probably talk to that guy. Something different would happen, but no. How do you how do you guys get this get the port smith? Uh, I don't I don't know. I mean, I I would assume it's just north of here, because I haven't been to port smith yet. The town that I was in previously was Kratos. There is, like, nothing to do out here in the sticks. I'm, like, so bored. <laughs> okay. Is that how people in in the past talk? In this old-timey runic village? Hello there. All our food is of the highest quality. Oh. Uh, a basic set of food ingredients consisting of staple foods such as rice, wheat, and millet. A basic set of food ingredients consists of various striped fruit collected from all seasons. Um, what is this all about? I don't know. I'm sure I'll figure it all out. It, I'll figure it all out later. Adam, I heard you were looking for someone to run an errand for you over to Portmouth. Yeah, I've got some cargo I need delivered from the Portmouth weapon shop, but I can't find anyone handy who'd be up to the job. It's been kind of tough to cross Mount Maytorks lately, hasn't it? Well, I'll let you know if I find anyone who can help. I can help. I mean, I guess not right now. I'm kind of dealing with more important matters at the moment. Look at how detailed this game is. Look at it. Welcome. I just like to buy some tools. Paralysis cure, that might come in handy. Are there any weapons? A harmonica? A reed instrument whose gentle sound is said to have a soothing effect on listeners. 
That's interesting. Oh, pickaxe. Is this a weapon? I might want that. I don't know. Welcome. Alright, I want to talk. I heard you needed someone to do a run over to Portmouth for you. Yep. There's some cargo I need delivered from the weapon shop in Portmouth. You'll get paid for your trouble, of course. And I'll also give you a permit to enter Portmouth. Sound good to you? Portmouth? The town to the north of here. We need a permit to enter? You just come off the boat, lady? They don't let anyone into that town if you don't have the right permit. Yeah. We'd like to take the job, sir. But only for the permit. Hmm. Well, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but you're going to need a real weapon. Oh, well, we'll come back later then. A real weapon? Is it that pickaxe? So I got to buy that pickaxe? Maybe. I'm just browsing. I see. Okay. Uh, would you like to listen to some advice on skills? Yes, I do. There are largely three reasons for learning skills. The first is to acquire the bonuses provided by each skill. For example, learning certain skills will boost your intellect. The second reason is to acquire specialties that you can learn by combining certain skills. There are over 10 specialties such as crafting and compounding, but it can take but it can take a lot of work to learn them all. The last reason for learning skills is to improve your combat abilities. Combat skills will give you advantage in any battle and can even offer more var variety in combat situations. I'm sorry for the long winded speech, but basically you should think carefully before distributing your skill points. As for the skills our guide offers, I recommend learning the knife. Skill, not only is it a necessary skill for for learning to, to for, 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 for the cooking speciality it also increases your attack power oh my god my reading comprehension oh boy can i talk to you uh hey you want some information on skills i can't learn any you can't learn any skills without it i'm just buying information i can just learn that on my own right my job is to explain the contents of each skill set would you like to hear about this information Wait, so this is not... Hold on a second. So, I'm not buying how to use them. I'm actually buying them. Okay, 300, 400, 400, 400. All right. Hope we make something out of it. 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 All right. I bought all of them because... I had enough money for it, so why not? So if I go to skills and go to learn skills, I have all of these skills I can buy. The ability to cut off a knife is required by all aspiring chefs. Raises strength by 10 per level. All right, I'll buy that. Um, I don't know, let me just look at all these. Qui-Gon randomly boosts defense, okay. Randomly boosts attack power. That sounds like it could be really nice. Randomly ignores an enemy's defense when attacking. That is expensive. The ability to correctly grasp the details of an object and make them your own. Courage can help one keep one's nerves even in front of a crowd. Huh? Raises the restorative effects of blueberries and blackberries by 3% per level. That sounds pretty cool, actually. But I, have a, but I have a feeling that there are better healing supplies than blueberries or blackberries, so I'm not sure about that. The ability to find pleasure in studying objects of beauty. All right, I'm going to buy some power burst. All right. I don't know. And I'm going to give Elia some Qui-Gon and some power burst because she is taking a lot of hits in battle. Like, like, she, like she's losing health pretty fast. Did I talk to you yet? Hey, I heard Badam at the item shop was looking for some adventurers. Yeah, I just talked to him. Look at look at how cute this game is. Oh my gosh. Like, I'm sure there are a lot of games that follow this kind of art style, but, you know, as someone who 
has only just like gotten to games like this. This is very pretty. It's really nice around here. I'm sure if I were living in the Sullivan, there'd be so many monsters around that I wouldn't be able to walk outside. My grandson insisted he was going to defeat the Archfiend and set off for Sylvalent. His father was the same. All I wanted was for them to be by my side, but they just wouldn't listen. Does Roddick not miss his mom at all? I'm getting a lot of these res resurrection elixirs. Like straight up. Like there is a good chance he's never going to see his mom again and he hasn't once mentioned her. I don't know. Maybe that's a trope in RPGs. Sora has never once m mentioned his mother after Kingdom Hearts 1, so... I don't know. Alright, let's see how good these skills are. Why am I, like, running all the way behind the enemy before I can attack them? Is it because of how Ilya's placed? I don't know. Okay, nothing over there. Whoa, okay. Encounter. Oh, just these things. Look, look how fast she is. How do I how do I run as fast as her? Look at that. I, I just I I just did a cool fire move. There we go. Ilya, you're really weak. Don't exert yourself. I got more uh, skill points to use. That's nice. This is not a cave. This really looks like a cave. Oh, what a Here they come. This is a new enemy. Oh, look, I slashed them. I did it. I actually did it. Actually, I want to check something out. I want to see if... Uh, not, not escape. Hold on a second. What's the... How do I... How do I use the... The swirling move. I can't remember. Target. I don't know. I can't figure it out. Like, how do I use MP? I used it last time. Like, if I go to skills, and then I go to... Wait, no, I mean specials, and then go to this. Oh, it's R1 and R and L1. Okay, so trigger buttons. All right, okay. I forgot that, all right. Look out. Was this, a little fun, huh? was this run button in the original version of the game? Because it's mapped to R2. And R2 was not on a PSP controller. Look at that, that's so cool. That is so cool. You can just get out, get out of Fire Sword whenever you want if you have the right amount of MP. Hello. This water is really good. It just wipes away your fatigue. Yes. Oh, cool. Could I do, could I do that last time? Look out. Give us a little fun, huh? Like does it also do that in the future? Oh my gosh, that move is really slow and it has no range. Shockwave Swirl? And why is it called Shockwave Swirl when it looks like water? Uh, Rose Hip. Oh, what a pain. I want to see if I can like hit all of them aerial style. No, that move sucks. Alright. Look at her jumping in the air. Can I do aerial attacks like that? Maybe. I got stuck there for a second. Pain. Here they come. 
it's like I can aerial attack, it's just really inconsistent. It's like the best method. The the best method is to just run up to them and attack from underneath. This is a really long path. Oh, what a pain! Oh, look at those. So oh, cool. Oh, did you see that? She just counterattacked it, or it just counterattacked her. Oh my gosh, these have a lot of health. There. Alright, there. Why did that one die so quickly? Palm of Destruction. I will give her that. Thank you. Nice. And we are here now. Check that out. Okay. Should I have gotten a better weapon? No, oh, what a Let's go. And the new enemy. Is, is this just the recolor of the first boss fight? I gotta stop wasting all that MP. It's just, it's just really fun to do. I'm not gonna use Shockwave Swirl anymore. That doesn't seem like a very good move. Man, I'm still not very used to the targeting system. I'll get to it eventually. Oh, nobody is allowed to pass through here without a permit. And back I go. Okay. All right. Oh, that's a cool animation. The game over screen is upside has an upside down A. That's kind of silly.